against a very amazing dwarf team. He didn't, yep. Right. Hello, everybody. Welcome to CCL Season 52 Round of 16 match between Hoily Boy and his Pro Elves and Kill Bill and his Underworld. In the booth with me is Dimmy G. Hello. Hello, Jimmy. Hello, everybody. Um, is this the this is the round of sixteen? Is it? It is. It's the round of sixteen. So we're getting into the business end of CCL. Both these lads have uh, come through some pretty tricky rounds so far. Um, oh, and well, that is that is a beautiful start for uh, Hoily Boy. Um, yeah, removing a tackle, Pommer. Thanks to the, the rock giving him the hit. Uh, oh, diced. Him. That's horrible as well. <laughs> oh my god, you there. Instant kill for Kill Bill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, instant tilt. Um, but yeah, I, I'm sure Kill Bill isn't tilted, but he's, he probably uh, died and uh, rolled his eyes at that. But, you know, that's Blood Bowl, isn't it? Yep, at least he lost the second best one, not the best one, eh? <laughs> yeah, no sign of a Daka here. I mean, Hoyley might just go out and just try and bang in a load of touchdowns here. <laughs> mm, well, Kill Bill's got, a, got the wizard here. Yeah, yeah. 12, 12 for Hoyley Boy, 14 for Kill Bill. And he's missed, he's missing his, he's one of his big ones. Oh my gosh, wow. And he's he's missing a reroll now. Yep. Double key. Gets the Kaz though. But just a just a shithead player. The interesting one to try and get some heat on the ball, I guess. Could have blitzed the, this guy with dodge and could have uh, cast him, but yeah, he wants to put Interesting the other thing I like obviously he wants to get someone down the pitch, but the other thing that's interesting is if you look at where Hoily Boy has put his players I don't think he's going that way. <laughs> <laughs> so the fact that Underworld are putting all their players over that side is is a little bit confusing to me personally. But you know, um, Kill Bill is a better coach than me, and uh, we'll see what the plan is. Yeah, it's not what I'd do, and now it looks like he's just going to try and snipe for the rest of the half because I mean, yeah, he might get, he might get lucky and you know fumble a pass here or whatever, but. Um, well, like I mean, to be fair, like it's going to be really difficult to get the ball off the pro elves, um, and I think I think maybe his best chance is attrition, um, and Hoyley's probably not going to score early because he's he's a good coach, like you know, it's it's. Uh, I guess the wizard makes it a bit more complicated. Yes, the wiz is the thing, isn't it? And I think that's what's making Hoyley boy uh, think like, about Like tend to push up on that, yeah. yeah. And, uh, and he, he doesn't want that edgy guy getting bolted, that's for sure. No, exactly. Exactly. That's why he's got the bolt, the bolt bait back to pick up the ball. Oh, is it called bolt bait now, is it? Because yes. uh, <laughs> that's not what I learned it as. <laughs> and it's not what I learned it as either, but now we're, being, we're all inclusive and politically correct. And uh, Oh, are we? Oh, yes. okay. I'll yes. see you later, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye now. <laughs> yes, uh, Tristan and Fluffy Brito. This is Blood Bowl too. Yes, it's it, it does look nice, doesn't it? You can see what the models are pretty pretty easily. Now, I mean, not really. It's right. a lot like yeah. Not really. I mean, fair. like I'd, if this was I, new, this would be a struggle. Some of this, wouldn't it? Right. Yes. So. You know, we, we we have got used to these, and that. it's very blurry. Like when you zoom out, the players are pretty bur blurry, and it doesn't look good. And a bit, tiny bit of clipping there. <laughs> yeah. So you know, it's not like it's not as if Blood Bowl Two is all sunshine and roses. Um, no. But it's our Blood Bowl Two, Jimmy. Yeah. And uh, a lot of horrible memories. <laughs> <laughs> Glorious. No, Hello, I'm it's Volcajo. Hello, Volcajo. 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 I will defend. Oh, he's switched Hi. sides. Is he going to put a foul in? He's not, is he? He's going to foul. I think he no. is going to. I think he is going to. Oh, not the ball carrier assist. This has never gone wrong before in Blood Bowl. It's never, ever gone wrong when you put your ball carrier next to... Uh, a body to, to to assist in a foul. Yeah, this is uh, this is a bit spicy. And thank you. I really hope you snake hosting. this. I really, I'm, I'm really <laughs> sorry, Hoodie, but I really hope you snake this foul because it will be hilarious. 
He's probably just gonna chasm him instead. Yeah, he will kill him, won't he? He'll be dead, dead, dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's dead, dead, dead. And that is I'm why you good. use your ball carrier as an assist every time. <laughs> is that the Apo? Yeah, yeah, of course. It's a, it's Kaz yeah. his, he's Kaz's his favourite player. His favourite player. I guess that would be the favourite as well, with the horns as well. Mm. Yeah, so, well, slightly better him. than the other one. Yeah, you've got to up for him. Yeah, exactly, Ducky. It was strange, wasn't it? He basically gave up uh, the defence on turn one. You would have thought you'd have used him to uh, not get him fouled. And instead, he hung him out to dry and gave up that massive gang foul. Uh, so, yeah. Well, I think, mean, yeah, like, honestly, I know I was joking about the, the full instant tilt. But <laughs> yeah. like, it, it might have thrown him off, like, his game plan for sure. Like, it is a factor that you can't rule out entirely. And now this is just, yeah, conceding the drive, waiting for a uh, second half to get your claw bombers back. Yeah. Or hopefully both of them. Yeah, and conceding the drive on turn three down both claw bombers isn't, isn't great, is it? <laughs> yeah. I mean, he's still got the one turn attempts and, uh, I mean, but how bad does his team look without those two claw bombers? Like, that, the, the whole team is literally those two players, isn't it? I mean, the troll's all right with guard and stand firm. It's not got block, but it has got claw. Which is absolutely useless in this matchup, um, and then he's got the leader Aji uh, thrower, which is is okay, but it, I mean it, it hasn't got dodge, so it's not hard to hit. Um, yeah, it's interesting. I mean, to be fair, if we boil it down to like Hoyle's team as well, like Hoyle's is is not the best Barov team by any stretch of the imagination either, but it's he's nice, got a couple of good players. Like the the blitzers are bland. Um, the only two players that I really like are the movement guard and the uh, Anchi guy. Um, He's basically got the absolute bare minimum you can have for a team here, isn't he? Yeah, <laughs> yeah boy, he's got, you know, no TV and, like in most games he'd be picking up wizards, but the fact that Kill Bill's got a wizard in this game just goes to show how low his TV must be, like because yeah. it's it's insane. And there uh, he does get a KO. Yeah. And, uh, Does use the, uh, the the old standard mighty blow. Yep. And no, Walcaho, this is not Blood Bowl 3 Underworld. This is Blood Bowl 2 Underworld, so there is no gutter runner on the Underworld. But he does yeah. get two claw pommers, which is pretty good. Unless one Yeah, because they lose, they lose a blitzer, don't they, for the gutter runner, don't they? Yeah. yeah There's only one blitzer, one gutter runner. Yeah. But they, 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 have they removed swarming there? No, they get swarming as well, don't they? So... Yeah, they nerfed they get... swarming though. They, they they nerfed swarming heavily, in fact. Yeah, it needed to be though, wasn't it? It was bonkers when it first <laughs> it appeared was, on the screen. Yeah. yeah, it was insane. Yeah. It's closer to the actual rules of the game. <laughs> they they definitely heavily nerfed swarming. Yeah. No, they definitely heavily nerfed. They they nerfed it for Underworld. They did a really good job of nerfing it for Underworld without nerfing it for Snotlings. But it was heavily nerfed for Underworld. That's a Kaz and a half as well, and this uh, mm. this undead uh, this Underworld team is absolutely falling to pieces. There is no Apo for that Agi4 uh, mm. thrower. That's the leader gone as well, which is obviously going to cost him a reroll. Um, so very very sad times for Kill Bill. He is going to get the two claw pommers back. Who is going to carry the ball? I hear you cry. Nobody knows. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows. <laughs> It's going to be a rookie goblin by the looks of it, and uh, it's literally going to be like stealing candy from a baby. Yep. No, it may be not, sorry, it may not be a rookie goblin, it may be a two heads goblin. <laughs> Even so, it's horrendous. Yep. Oh, this is the guard guy, and now this is this is probably what Hoidy is going to fear the most, is just getting cast out, um, winning and just losing the two good players that he's got <laughs> yeah I mean it can still be very strong Volcaho and it can still be heavily nerfed right you know if you if you tied one hand behind uh, Francis Nagano's back he'd still fucking kill you <laughs> so, so, yeah uh, probably you know. <laughs> it has definitely been heavily nerfed does he think I, does Christoph Christopher think I'm Hellboy <laughs> um, yeah maybe uh, <laughs> Oh, you just wow. randomly asking Hellboy. 
<laughs> I don't know. Doesn't know who the champ is. Oh my god. What does he think you're Andy Davo or El Duderino? And I'm Hellboy. I don't know. I don't know who he thinks Hellboy is. One of the best teams, not insanely bonkers like they were before. Hmm. They're still pretty good. Still yeah. pretty good. There's only one way to know, and that's if you see. <laughs> Isn't it funny how like you give a team a gutter runner, and then suddenly they become a good team? <laughs> Yeah, that is funny, isn't it? But yeah, it, also the swarming was huge. And like, it's still big, it's just, it was huge. Yeah. It's Dr. Hellboy, I heard the other day. Oh, it, it is. is. Yeah, he's got his doctor, is not he? Oh, yes. Yeah. Hello, yes. Fime here. Hello there. Are you sharing <laughs> the screen, Jimmy? Because I can see... Uh, someone did ask, in your absence, someone did ask what country we're dedicating the stream to. I ignored it because I didn't know. Um, oh my god, uh, thanks god I'm here, you know, to yeah. tell the people that this game is dedicated to the people of the Central African Republic. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Which the national flower is the Protea Sinaroides and the national dish is the Pulet Niemge. <laughs> Thank you very much, Fami. <laughs> and it has a density of 8 people per square kilometer. So, if they want to make a tabletop tournament, <laughs> they're gonna need airplanes. I mean, to be fair, I probably need airplanes and I live in the UK. Hastings <laughs> 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 is so barren for tabletop. Yeah, you could get a plane up to, uh, up to Nikon, couldn't you? <laughs> UK <Yeah>. Chelsea. <laughs> Hancock mentioned it earlier in Elliot's stream. He's like, yeah. you should just fly to stop. Like well, time. a plane, mm. well, maybe yes, a private plane or something like that. I don't think uh, York has uh, an airport. <laughs> no, Stockport does. There's Stockport Airport, isn't there? I think. Or Manchester, there'll be Manchester Airport. On Newcastle? Mm, yeah, Dr. Hellboy. Dr. Hellboy. Yeah, I, 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 I luckily placed one place higher than Volcaja at Water Bowl, <laughs> even though he was halflings, and only because one of his opponents didn't play three of their games. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> so, if he'd played, like, one game more, like, I probably would have, uh, Volcaja would have beat me. But he, he did the classic submarine in, like, lose your first game and then win the next five or something like that. Like, proper, you know, backhanded tactics, you know. No Absolute good, no good. Like... Dirty Dino. Yeah. Oh yeah, of course, the classic uh, excuse after losing the first one. It was yeah. all according to plan. <laughs> yeah. I'll just uh, do these extra GFIs even though I don't need them, you know. Yeah. Oh, I'll just... I'm going to throw a pass here. <laughs> I was trying to get the SPPs for the next round. <laughs> yeah, you know, res SPP, you not heard about it? No. <laughs> Uh, ten places ahead of me. Yeah, what if he'd actually uh, played his games? Wow. Well, Volcayo, you mentioned that as it was a difficult thing to do. <laughs> yeah. I got diced basically. Like I would have won it, but I had to play Kafo. So. You know. I mean, if it was the real Dimi, you know, like the the one that was at the Andy Davo tournament, you know, the real Dimi, yeah, that was. Oh, he probably would have won it, yeah, yeah. If I came 12th, he would have won it for sure, for <laughs> sure. Oh, there's a Kaz. Mm. Just a dodge Lino, is that? Yep. Yeah, oh, you beat someone, yeah. It was a, it was a well known player PC, one of the members of the England team, in fact. Oh, wow, really? Yes. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah, who then refused to play the second day of the tournament, but still decided to turn up and sit there while he didn't play Pompol, wow. <laughs> which was, was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Um, but you, you know me, I found it hilarious, because <laughs> those things kind of are. <laughs> <laughs> was it Joe Manji? Oh, how did you... Well, I, I can't confirm or deny it, you know, I can't confirm or deny it. Okay, yeah. I, I would guess out of the England team. <laughs> uh. <laughs> But, uh, but if the ones to be salty, it could be him. It wasn't Kfo though, that's for sure. He was. Uh, I think he came third in the end. Mm. Uh, and then, but to be fair, like the only reason Kfo came third was because my strength of schedule was so good, like because I had such mm. a good record that it put him above other players that you may have heard of, like Andy Davo and such. Mm. And, you know. 
Okay, yeah. gentlemen, we have an actual game here now that the bo uh, both club bombers uh, are here. Yep. Who's going to carry the ball for me? Four players down for. Oh, the, the two heads uh, goblin or the ball carry or the it's thrower. Gonna, it's got a second thrower, right? Oh, that throwers. cheeky guy. Because okay. they, they lose so, the second thrower, don't they, in uh, Blood Bowl 3, so uh, Blood Bowl 2020, whatever you want to call it. So they, they, they go down to one thrower, but they still got two throwers in Blood Bowl 2, so yeah, there's the backup thrower. Yeah, we know. Yeah, the blitzer we've. Uh, yeah, we'd already said that chat, right? all. That's why it was also they lose the. They, lose, they also lose the second draw. <laughs> so, what was the objective there? Making Underworld better? Because. Doesn't sound like it. I don't know. They probably were trying to nerf it, but accidentally made it really strong <laughs> judge it by what they did it, to the they, rest of they the just team. did it they, no it was just based on sprues right the sprue has got three linos one blitzer one thrower and one gutter runner so that's what they did they just they just did it literally uh... the sprue. <laughs> sprue. i mean at the end of the day i know it sounds mental but if you're passing the ball in blood bowl you're not playing it right <laughs> like, no exactly they're, they're better in Blood Bowl 2 with only one thrower but obviously yeah. having the second thrower here when it's only 20 TV has worked out pretty nicely because he had a sure hands and he's got a block and he's if, got you've, if you've made a pass in the game you've done something horribly wrong unless you've got like a thrower on a pro elf team I guess which is or horribly right only... because you've turned over your opponent and now you're picking up in two tackle zones and then passing it away and scoring against them right yeah, yeah, mate. I tried to do a pass um, with a Imperial Nobility lineman the other day, and it was like four squares away, and it was like a six plus, and I was just like, "Oh my god, <laughs> it's just horrendous!" Like, yeah, it's a joke. Oh, got him! Yep. Hello, flicky, flicky, flicky. Huge pal. Claw actually useful as well because it's a blitzer. I mean, it didn't have an effect, but it could have done. <laughs> You say passing is fantastic, but I can only see the pro elf and like potentially the human thrower, although I doubt it. And then the wood elf thrower, if anyone ever plays wood elves ever again. Oh, they're still good wood elves. I didn't see I didn't see any wood elves at Water Bowl, but I'm sure there must have been some there. But I I, I didn't see any. I mean, they're and, still um, good, right? They're still good. They still have war dancers. So. Yeah, but the dark elves are just better, aren't they? Like yeah. I, there was eleven dark elves, put it that way, and yeah. I saw them like when, as I was playing, I saw them everywhere, and I didn't see any woodies the whole time I was there, yeah. and I don't know how many were there, if yeah. any. Yeah, but you know, like you didn't see well, you, if if they mistiered pro elves or high elves, you would never see high elves or pro elves. Well, there was no tears, were there? There's no tears of no, water. No, but you know, in, in the old days, you would never see them, would you? You know, it was always wood elves and dark elves. Oh yeah, yeah. So, just... so now, of course, it's all dark elves because dark elves are the best. <laughs> but what else? Yeah, there was. Yeah, what else are still the second best elves, and they're still good. They're just not winning like fifty-six percent anymore. They're like winning fifty-one percent or fifty-two percent, like a normal good team. Yeah, I am surprised at the win rates on races, but... but then I see some people playing those races, and then I'm like, oh, okay. Well, it's good, uh, a good little run up here, isn't it? They can get down the field quite well. Just got a. They've got no guard, though, have they? This team. Well, they've got they've got a guard on the troll, but only one guard on the troll. Um, so they've kind of got to keep the ball next to the troll in a way, if you want any guard on it. He's doing. I thought he's doing a finger bus, but no. Uh. He can't really afford to do it, can he? I mean, Penemy, you can't say 2016 Underworld wasn't actually overpowered at all, apart from all of the things that made it overpowered. <laughs> he obviously didn't play against Yaks 1000 TV claw pomming Underworld with no rerolls, because uh, I'm pretty sure he'd have a different opinion. <laughs> I remember when I first started playing Blood Bowl, like playing a rookie Chaos team and spinning into like two claw pommers and like God knows what else, and uh, getting absolutely demolished by a. Uh, Yuck. 
Let me. So Hoyle is running out of players. There is a wizard in play as well. Yeah, four kill Bill though. So this is looking pretty strong for kill Bill here. Yes. Well, you say pretty strong. I don't know. I still have some doubts and some concerns, but he needs the power that uh, side step on me. Oh, there you go. There is a lot of uh, tanks left. So oh, he's breaking out into the middle, piling on. Why is he sidestep that way? I don't know, Jeff. I thought oh. the obvious. Oh, that is sadness. Ooh. And that could be. GG! Don't say it's over, Dim. It could be, couldn't it? Uh, yeah. It's awkward. It's awkward to get to the ball, though. Not if he pals, not if he pals this right. You can get the guard in the back then. And he does get the power. Oh, and then he goes through. Yeah, I see. I, I see it. Don't follow. Slap the guard in. Bob's your father's brother. Yep. And then, uh. Instant don't, 2D. Don't say it's over, but. Oh! It's over. <laughs> oh! Oh, he does burn the reroll. No, it's not over. Ball stays Where's in. Where's this ball? Ball stays in. Oh, oh. that's interesting. Wait, well, he's going to scatter it now, isn't he? Yeah. And then he's off to the races. One in, oh, is it three and eight? Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! oh, that's not too bad either. Three plus, two plus. Yep. No dodge. Yep. Oh, it's a four plus pickup. It doesn't hand off. Interesting. That I would have been yeah. pretty tempted to hand off and run away. Oh, but he's still having me. Yeah, he just punch in me. Yeah, okay, that's, that's better. And gets the stun as well. Yeah, and the bolt is pretty useless here as well because he's so far away. Yeah, but see, I quite like the handoff because then if you hand it off, then then it's like it's a line yes. getting bolted, isn't it? But yeah, that's that's oh, and he's niggled as well. Oof. Oh, oh brutal. Oof. And he catches it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Cheers. Oh my god. Oh my oh, god. Oh. oh, in the blizzards as well. Oh, we would have failed it anyway, but you know. It catches him. Oh my god, he's. Just... <laughs> oh, he's he catch it? He was getting annihilated. He doesn't catch it, and he's he's gonna have to oh. get it with something else. It's gonna be that cobble, isn't it? He's gonna have to go through all the tackle zones. This, this Maybe it's double. the two heads one. No, nah, it's gonna be this one. Oh, he's on diving tackle. Yeah, yeah. So it's on DT. DT wrecks goblins. To be fair, as well. It absolutely demolishes them. It so does, yeah. Power armor and uh, yeah, Penny. I mean, I knew, I knew that when Dimmy was saying about Yak, it was the wrong thing. But you, you literally said they weren't overpowered apart from all of the things that made them overpowered. <laughs> so like, they were overpowered. <laughs> it was just a strange thing to come out with. I thought. They weren't overpowered, it was just all of these things that they had that made them overpowered. <laughs> and also, the, the main thing with Underworld as well in, like, was just the mistier, right? The, the table. Yeah, top that was tearing, yeah, so they were getting loads in their package, yeah. Yeah. And that was really And it was, uh, it was Hackflem as well, wasn't it? Um, or who's the gutter runner with three arms? Yeah, Hackflem. Yeah. yeah, he was a cause for concern. Yep. Star players are just completely busted, like in 2020. Yeah, I mean, well, particularly in uh, particularly in NAF. Uh, NAF, yeah, because the NAF has only got a thousand TV teams to deal with. Oh wow, Agi guy, no Apo, sat right next to a tackle bomber. <laughs> yep. Oh dear. Oh, well, is it really used these Apo? I don't, I'm not sure actually. I know yeah, the Underworld used them. I'm sure he has because it just. Yes, he used it. the Apo for a KO. Ah, uh, did he? Wow. <laughs> Shows you a lack of confidence. Mm. Which is fair. Yeah. To be fair. Oh, he dodges off the edgy guy! Just, oh, I would have killed the. I, I would have conceded the game and just killed the edgy guy. But <laughs> <laughs> well, he can kill this guy as well and maybe not concede the game. Oh, he's injured. What is it? What is it? Oh, boo! I mean, to be fair, I shouldn't be booing because like Hoyle's team's going to be absolutely wrecked regardless. I mean, he's pretty beaten up already, isn't it? So. Yep. He's already dead. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So yeah, so we've got two scoring threats now. And then can try and uh, get it with a thrower. Uh, if only there was an uh, AG5 elf stood next he's to the ball. He's got it! He's got it! He's got the he's ball! Got, oh. He's got to throw it though, hasn't he? But you just hold on to it? Oh wow, he's not even blitzing. Okay, he's just gonna block. He's gonna block the ball, I guess. Yeah, yeah. But put the guard in. Yeah. Okay. But he's yeah, not. He's not tagged the scoring threat. No, because he's just gonna knock the ball down and pick it up. Oh. Ooh. Oh, massive pow and the school beat. Oh. And why did he hit? Oh, because he's got. Oh. <laughs> why wouldn't you hit? The Lino and then dodge the edgy out. I guess it doesn't matter. This gives you an extra hit. This gives you an extra hit, right? If it's a push. And now he can oh, uh, yeah, chain good. to get the four. Quite an exciting end to this, isn't it? Yeah. It's not over. Don't say it's over. So he's not going troll blitz, which is probably the right. Oh, can't pile on. Imagine if he catches it. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh, he doesn't oh, get Oh, it's just badly hurt. Oh, but he hasn't, oh, used, he hasn't used the blitz yet, so he can blitz him. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, and that's it. Oh, that's no, GG. Oh, no. What a game. What an end to the game there. That was uh, yeah. pretty pretty exciting. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, pretty, pretty great game. Seven. Well, not seven cast. Six cast and a send off for Holy Boy. Yeah. And somehow, somehow getting it done with about five players left on the pitch. Flip me. Yeah, that was good. Good. Yeah, I think Hoily Boy will uh, feel very relieved at that one, and uh, I think um, Kill Bill will feel a little bit hard done by as well. Mm, there you go. Commiserations, Kill Bill. Congratulations, Hoily Boy. Thank you very much, Dimmy and Fimi. Have been glorious having you guys in the booth. It's always a pleasure to be here, and I hope the people in the Central African Republic enjoy this fantastic game full of action and casualties. And thanks for watching everyone, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.